Hello friends, in this video we will see formation of eutectic structure. I am Dr. Wasim Sheikh. Let us start. So here we will look at the formation of eutectic structure with the help of an example. And the example which we will be looking into is the lead and tin phase diagram. Also, the, also it is called as lead and tin system. Here on the x axis you can see weight percent of tin. On the y axis you can see the temperature and the eutectic reaction is happening here where the liquid is transforming into alpha and beta phases and we know exactly at the eutectic reaction just below the eutectic reaction there will be a lamellar layer which will be forming of alpha and beta now how this lamellar layer forms why it is formed uh, let us see that but before moving on further let us see what is so peculiar about alpha and beta phase the alpha phase we have to first remember that the alpha phase is rich in lead okay alpha phase is rich in lead that means lead is more in alpha phase similarly the beta phase beta phase is rich in tin so here you can see this is the weight percent of tin so almost around 98 99 percent of tin is there in beta phase and almost you know similarly you know around this is 18.3 so you can say that around you know more than 80 percent of uh, you know composition is there in the alpha phase so like that we can see you know just uh, as an example uh, a ballpark uh, figure i am giving you that what is there in alpha and beta phase so alpha is rich in lead beta is rich in tin and just build the eutectic point this is what is happening so now liquid is transforming into this lamellar phase. So liquid is transforming into the lamellar phase. Now as we have seen that alpha phase is rich in lead. So all the lead which is there in the liquid phase will move towards alpha. So this is lead and now it is moving towards alpha. And similarly all the tin which is there in the liquid phase will move towards the beta phase. So this is what it is happening here exactly liquid phase when it is forming solid this is how the redistribution is happening the redistribution of lead and tin is happening as per the figure which is shown here the lead particles the lead will go in the alpha phase and the tin will go in the beta phase and this is this, this is what we will be seeing this is this is what which is happening here the actual image will look like this so this is the actual image where you can see the lamellar layer means one layer upon another of lead and tin can be seen here so alpha and beta layered eutectic grows and replaces the liquid phase so the liquid phase which is here is replaced by the alpha and beta layered structure the process of redistribution of the beta the process of redistribution of lead and tin occurs by diffusion in liquid just ahead of the eutectic and the liquid interface so eutectic and liquid interface is there there is a redistribution which is happening of lead and tin and we know that diffusion is the dominant mechanism and migration happens in diffusion and all these lead and tins are getting migrated towards the favorable condition which is how they are forming the different phases the arrows indicate the direction of diffusion and of lead and tin atoms lead atoms diffuse towards the alpha phase layers because this alpha phase is lead rich so the alpha phase is rich in lead that is why all the lead atoms are moving towards the alpha phase and the beta phase is rich in tin so all the tin atoms are moving towards the beta phase so this is how the formation of eutectic structure happens in the lead and tin system thanks for watching all the best